welcome, welcome, welcome. It looks like we got some new information today for those of you who are looking for more information on the four rent expansion pack for The Sims 4. It looks like they are going to give us a maximum of six new apartment units that you can have. This is great. I don't know how many people were expecting. I know different YouTubers were unsure. Some people were saying just two lots. I didn't think it was only going to be two lots. That wouldn't have been worth making an expansion pack over. But it looks like um, EA decided to stop the misinformation <laughs> and show that it will be a maximum of six units. So you can have just two units if you would like, like a duplex. But if you want to make a apartment building, you can have up to six units. This is fantastic. I don't think I would have wanted to um, run anything more than six units, to be honest. Um, it might become a little overwhelming if you have too many uh, apartment buildings or apartment uh, units to take care of so I think six is a good number and it's an even number so I don't know I got a thing about having odd numbers but yes you can have up to a maximum of six units per lot obviously if you're doing a duplex or um, you know you just wanted two two units right next to each other you could just do a duplex just do two uh, but you could do row houses like this. You could do all six on a row house or you can build up. Now, one thing I did, <clears throat> I hear, heard someone say is, oh, you're not going to be able to build a skyscraper. Um, I don't know how this feature is going to work if you own the city living pack. But my thought would be since we could build any type of home on the existing penthouses in city living in San Mishuno. There's nothing stopping you from building on top of a skyscraper in city uh, city skyline. Sorry, oh, city skylines. Uh, there's nothing stopping you from building on top of a penthouse in uh, San Mishuno. So in fact, yeah, you could have a skyscraper apartment. Uh, you would just be building it to look as close as possible to what the existing shell looks like um and you would i assume use the elevator to get up there just like you do now uh there's nothing stopping you from going and building a store on top uh where the penthouses are so that's a different lot tag it doesn't have to say residential you actually could even go and build a vacation a uh, lot, a uh, a rental lot right now on top of a skyscraper in uh, City Sky, I keep saying City Skyline, sorry guys, <laughs> on uh, Sam Ishuno. So yeah, I think you could go and build uh, your skyscraper apartments in Sam Ishuno with the City Living Pack as long as you are building on a lot that's buildable. I think there are two penthouses. Correct me if I'm wrong, there might be three. I think there's even one that's labeled as a bar or a lounge, but you always could change that tag to be residential, or you could change it now and make, now when we have these new rentals, you could change it to, to be something that else that you want. But yes, you can have a skyscraper apartment in city in in uh, city living. Now, that's been said. I also think, and and I don't know until we get the pack, that even if you can only build six units, there's nothing stopping you. Let's say you wanted to build twelve units. You could build 12, it's just probably the game will only allow you um, to activate six of those apartments. So while they're drawing out different examples that you see on the screen, you could make your apartment house as many uh, units as you want. 
I think the game mechanics is going to limit you on how many people will come and uh, pay you. So even though they're only drawing you here on the screen six units, you could draw out 12 if you wanted the building to just appear to have, you know, a, a larger amount of units. It's just they won't be filled with tenants. Does that make sense? Um, also, that might not be a bad idea if you wanted to decorate some of them and leave the others as empty shells because you just wanted them to give the effect of a big building. So those are just some ideas. I've got a couple other ideas, but I'm going to make this short. So I'm going to quickly say that I know a lot of people wanted hotels. And though this may not be a hotel, because we can build this in any world and you can have six units that will populate with tenants, you could still feel as though you are a property manager. Um, if you wanted to build like some huts, or um, some log cabins in, uh, we can't do vacation worlds, but we have plenty of worlds that look like vacation worlds. You could use the high school pack if you own it and build log cabins in the woods in uh, the high school pack. I forget the name of the town, but yeah, Copper Copperdale, I believe it is. Um, you could build log cabins, um, or sorry, you could build some little huts um, in a vacation world, or, or sorry, in Sulani, and make it feel like they are time sharing. I know uh, quite a few people who time share. So you kind of own those homes, um, but you really don't. You just share the property and you vacation there. But for your gameplay, it will look like you are a property manager of time shared vacation homes. And then that way you can feel like you're running a hotel, sort of, kind of. <laughs> um, someone else mentioned that you could do trailer parks in uh, Oasis Springs is the perfect place. So uh, we already have, um, what's his name? Johnny Zach's living in a trailer. You could build a trailer park and basically be a manager of a trailer park. So yeah, those are some ideas. I'm sure we will have many, many more. But don't feel too bad if we didn't get the vacation pack. I'm sure EA is probably working on that too. They want our money. So I'm sure they will probably be working on that hotel pack. Um, and don't give up on cars because I know I haven't. Let me slow down this trailer for one second here though because I just want to see... In better detail because this is going super fast I would love to see look at that it's still going fast all right there we go let's break it down a little bit so there's your six units and, and then they're showing you right there that you could have uh, your college students you could build your own uh, college campus basically college dorm rooms I wonder, I, I can't see why you couldn't, when you're in the college world, you can go ahead and build it, build your uh, rentables right there in the college world. So here's a vacation looking idea. Here's Oasis Springs where you could do the trailer park idea as well. It's, it's too bad we didn't get the spiral stairs. I know someone mentioned those. I would have loved to have gotten spiral stairs in this pack. I don't know why they didn't add them. Maybe they'll come as a game update. We do still have to get an update. So that might, might still happen. Maybe it's going to be a little surprise during the live stream. They always do a live stream. Or maybe they didn't add them. I don't know, but we'll see. I'm happy that they used uh, more packs when showing it here because it just gives people more ideas. So this is pretty cool. I think I'm gonna go build an apartment today. <laughs> oh, this is great. You know what? I have an old apartment. I might go and edit it. Might. <laughs> 
I, I built a, a hotel back in the day. Uh, it had a restaurant and a, and a gym and a bunch of other stuff in it. But uh, I might go and tweak that. This is nice. Oh, I'm excited, guys. I hope you are, too. All right. I'm going to go.